Okay. We also made validation uh, more prominent in the UI. Um, before you had to click like a model dialog that will show up and block everything. Now it's possible to run validation while you enter data and it will show up in the, in the right side panel. So we also group things by high, by priority. So you can now see what are high priority problems and what are high medium priority and low priority violations of the form. So this is helpful to basically uh, emphasize the most significant validation problems uh, and allows you to kind of focus on the most, the most important uh, validations to fix. So once again, let's have a look. Uh, we can go ahead and say run validation and that will run validation this form. As we can see, there's two medium priority alerts. Um, you can see that PCV2 cannot be higher than PC1 doses given and so on. Um, and again, you can, you can also just keep entering data, keep navigating the form. You can click run validation again to rerun validation all while entering data in the form. In the future, we also want to run this automatically in a more intelligent way so that you can actually then, uh, so no, users can be notified about validation problems even without clicking the validation button. We know that is a problem that many people don't click run validation at all. So we want to make this more automatic and more intelligent in, in the coming releases.